Hello, hello, hello. If you are watching this video, then you are probably an Acoustica Mixcraft user. Now, I've been using Mixcraft for about 10 years now, and I know it pretty well. So if you have any questions, uh, ask me down in the comments below, and I'll do my best to answer as fast as I can. Now, today I'm going to show you how to get Waves plugins to work in Mixcraft. So if you are a Waves user, and you are having problems getting waves to uh, run in Mixcraft, this is what you do. And you act, you do this for all plugins, actually. Um, <clears throat> okay, so you bring it, you, uh, you go up to the little settings bar right here, or you can, you can go to file, then preferences to get to the same spot, or you can just hit this little gear icon and it'll bring that right up. Now, you're gonna go down to plugins. Like I said, you do this with all plugins anyways. Um, so what you're gonna do to begin with is you're gonna edit. You're gonna go to edit VST, VSTI folders. And now when you download Waves plugins, it'll show you where the plugins are downloading at and where your Waves shell will be at. And so you wanna go into add right here, right? And you wanna go there to wherever it is that the wave shell and, and whole waves plugins folder is at and in my case it's in programs files x86 um, <clears throat> and then you know you go there you choose it you hit ok and it adds it into here then you're gonna hit ok which I'm not gonna do right now because I don't need to do it but you're gonna hit ok and it'll scan all that um, and 99 and nine times out of 10, that should work. Um, what you'll need to do after this is you'll have to close out of Mixcraft up here and, and restart it to see if it worked and whatnot. And now then you go to the effects plugins, the effects bar and scroll down. You'll see all, all these waves plugins <clears throat> in here. So that should be all you need to do in Mixcraft to get Waves plugins to go. So you need to go up here to the gear icon, edit VST, VSTI folders, add, go to the folder where your Waves and Waves VST and VST plugins are at, which will contain the Waves shell plugin, um, well, the Waves shell file that has the plugins. And you add it in here, you click OK, and then you restart Mixcraft and come back into it. Another thing you can do um, is if you've already added waves into here and you notice they're not working properly, you can rescan all VST plugins, or you can completely remove the folder and re-add it in again, and it should work normally. I've had these issues many, many times and have had to re-add waves plugins into Mixcraft way too many times. But that's all right, because it really is an easy fix. Um, I hope this video helped you. If it did, let me know down in the comments below and, and give the video a like. And I'll do more videos like this, mainly based around Mixcraft, because I am an avid Mixcraft user, and I know it like the back of my hand. and know it really well. And Mixcraft is a very underrated DAW, and I love using it. I make all my music on it. My music will be linked in the description. And I mean, I, I think you'll like my music. I make really good music. <clears throat> so go check that out on Spotify, Apple Music, anywhere else you stream music on YouTube. All that good stuff. Again, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.